Hi, it's Joan Butts. This week, I'd like to look at limit raises. A limit raise is a hand as responder where you decide that it's too strong for a single raise to two and not strong enough for a game force raise. So a limit raise usually shows 11 or 12 points and that includes shortage or dummy points because once there's a fit, you can add your shortages because they'll improve the way a hand plays. So a limit raise will say to partner, partner, you won't need much for game. You've opened one heart or one spade. I'm telling you three hearts or three spades. Please go to game if you possibly can. And so it's always better to have four trumps than three to make a jump. So there are other ways to describe hands with 11 or 12 points and three card trump support. Try to keep it to having four trumps and a very nice 11 or 12 points that contains some shortage, either a singleton or a doubleton. You can add extra for those shortages onto your high card points. So try the hand I've given you. And the main thing is that if you make the decision to say three hearts when partners open one heart, you're telling partner that you're very close to being able to go to game if they've got a reasonable opening. Whereas opening one heart and if you respond only two hearts, partner needs a very strong hand to move any further than a part score. In the beginning of February, I have some Zoom lessons coming up. They're brand new material and I'm looking for the first time at both sides of the table with competitive bidding. The first is when we interfere with the opponent's bidding and then the second is once partners opened and they've interfered, how do we manage after that? It's a crucial time in bidding. I'm also offering a beginner's course. So if you have any friends who'd like to start right from the beginning, go to my website and book in for that. Have a good week, everyone. Partners opened one heart and we've got a nice fit. We've got four trumps for partners, five or more. So we will definitely want to play in hearts. Our points are 10 high card points, but because there's a heart fit, we can add an extra point, a shortage point or a dummy point for the doubleton spade. So this hand is too good for two hearts. Let's make a limit raise of three hearts and see if partner can go to game. Yes, they have. So counting our winners and losers, we've got one winner in diamonds and only one loser because there's a doubleton here and we can trump that third diamond. In clubs, we're missing the ace, so there's one loser. In spades, we're missing uh, the queen and the jack, etc. But we've got two spade losers here, but they're not losers because of the lovely doubleton in the south hand. That's why shortages do add to a hand's value when there's a trump fit. Because we've got hearts, we'll be able to trump these spades. And in, in trumps itself, we've got one loser. So we should make four heart tricks, two spade tricks are six, one club is seven, one diamond is eight, and two trumps are ten. So I'm pleased that we went to game, that partner decided to go to game. Let's um, not touch trumps until we've tested the spades. Now, because we've got the nine and the jack, we could trump a spade and we could trump it high. Now we can touch trumps. And they're returning a diamond. And we can trump this diamond. Now we should trump the spade they're trumping with a heart, that won't do them much good. So we can over trump and play the jack of hearts over to the queen. And we've got only one loser, the ace of clubs.
So although North had a minimum opening hand, 12 high card points, when we said three hearts, they could also add for their shortages, which were very valuable because having a diamond doubleton meant we didn't lose two diamond tricks, we only lost one. Having a club doubleton meant we only lost to the ace. And in the south hand, having a spade doubleton meant we were able to trump. So shortages, when you have a trump fit, definitely make the hand more valuable. And when we chose to make a limit raise, partner doesn't need much to go on to game.